morning and welcome to Thursday. I honestly cannot believe that it is Thursday already. I definitely thought yesterday was Tuesday for a lot of the day. Anyways, it is about 10 to 9. <clears throat> I'm just getting ready for my webinar. I'll probably log in in a couple minutes here. Um, but I'm also opening up Photoshop because I have to Photoshop the theater floor plans to go with the document that I'm making because I've broken the entire theater down into zones. So I guess visuals, visuals are good. I had some, well, I had one weird dream that I can remember last night, which was survivor related. Nick Jonas and his wife, uh, Priyanka Chopra were playing survivor. They were on different teams, but, and also Joe Jonas was there and it was just kind of weird. <laughs> And I was playing too, and it turns out I was cousins with Joe Jonas. I mean, well, Joe and Nick Jonas, but nobody knew. Um, and I found myself alone with the two of them, even though they were on different tribes. See, it was really complicated. Also, Nick Jonas had a cell phone, which Jeff Probst said, everybody gets one phone call home. And I was like, mm, I don't think that's right. Anyways, I was like, how about the three of us? Nobody will ever suspect us. Nobody knows we're related. And so I made a final three deal. But also we were, part of the survivor thing was taking care of dogs, which was great, and making masks. So, weird dreams. Anyways, I slept a lot better last night than I have in the last couple nights, so that's nice. I wish I could have slept a little bit longer, but got work to do, so I'm just gonna... I changed my shirt because I, I don't think it's a, a, with a video. Wow, my brain is not working well. Um... But in case it was, I did not want to be wearing my pajama shirt that says, like, has a sloth on it and then says, let me sleep. I feel like I'm slurring my words. So I'm going to go, I'm going to log into this, take some notes, and then just try to put in, like, three, four hours of work on that document. And then I rewrote my list yesterday, and then do the list. <laughs> Well, hello again. I am back. It has been quite some time. It is 20 after 2 now, so I worked until 12.30 on my fun thing, <laughs> which included, like, taking floor plans, and I had to modify them because they're very outdated floor plans, so I had to, like, well, that's a bathroom now, and so Photoshop skills were coming in handy, and then I color-coordinated everything to be the zones that I've separated everything into so that's very exciting like this is the downstairs zones and then this is the upstairs zones but yeah like I said especially upstairs like everything has changed around so much like the boardroom used to be an office and the copy room used to be an office and the office that is beside it was the copy room and there was apparently only one bathroom upstairs so yeah I had to go through modify things I had to add the orchestra pit on because it's not on any of the plans so that was fun that was what a lot of my morning was spent doing and then just updating things based on the stuff I learned in the webinar and then so just after 12 30 my mom and I departed the house because I needed more elastic like this was all I had left well I mean I have like that much of it and I need it more and also that fabric store like I said it's it's go away it's changing ownership so everything's selling and I need it more stuff oops <laughs> I did it again I spent my money and got so much fabric <laughs> but like seriously so I got um oh my god my brain a magnetic pin holder which is super convenient like I have been playing the game of the front part of my laptop is magnetic so I've been putting my little pin cases on top of it so that holds the pins in but this will just be so much better to actually have and use regularly and then I'll have a third seam ripper because that's what I need it I got a couple more floss colors which I definitely didn't need so there's like two really bright yellows two pinks and two greens that I just fell in love with did not need those because I still have not wound these guys it's fine don't worry about it 20 meters of elastic <laughs> which this and then I also picked up some of these uh, which I can split in half and then we stopped at Walmart afterwards to see if they had any of the smaller stuff because it, it was a 20 meter limit. I couldn't get more than 20 meters um, and then I picked up some more that I can split in half. So 
yeah. I decided because they were 50% off to get some more of my embroidery, that's so bright, embroidery cardboard bobbins. So figured I would get those. And then the rest is just thread, which I'll leave in there because there's quite a few. I picked up this nice shiny ye mustardy yellow remnant. So like eventually I want to just start making kind of plain scrunchies so that if I wanted to bundles, I could bundle like some mustard, do like two patterns and mustard. And I have some green and I have some burgundy that I picked up last time. So I got this and then I picked up this remnant, which is really fun. I don't know. It's kind of very dated looking, but also kind of cool. And it was like five bucks for over a meter. So, and then the rest of the fabric I got, I got nine more fabric, nine more meters. I was, I said I was gonna get six, but if they were 50% off, then I could get two in lieu of one, if that makes sense. So this guy here is Winnie the Pooh and Tigger and it's a nice blue and there's Eeyore on it there too, 50% off. Piglet's on there as well. I think it's just Eeyore, Piglet, Tigger and Pooh. Also 50% off is Ghosts. They're so fun. I believe these crabs were also 50% off, so that's fun. I like the color. I literally just buy stuff that I would want to wear in my hair. Like I got a star one in my hair right now. And um, if other people want them, that's awesome. Mushrooms, ha ha ha. Dragonflies, super cute. And the, the gold ones are shiny. I got some anchors because I figured they'd be like universally appreciated also. I like the color. I got some owls because come on, owls. Who do you think you are? Some mini mouse with a shiny gold one. That was like impossible to match the thread color for that one. It was hard. And then some more Winnie the Pooh and friends. Yeah. So I just spent a lot of money again. I don't know if I sh ever showed all the different fabrics that I got um, last time because I wasn't vlogging at the time, but now that's, I got 14 meters last time and then another nine meters this time. That's a lot. And then on top of that, I bought remnant stuff both times. But yeah, so that's where we're at. Um, I sent an email to my boss being like, uh, in Blind Channel to be like, hey, do you have a date for me? Like when I might be coming out? And um, I got no response. Well, I sent this meme that I found last night because my boss hates and loves puns. Optimus, the bucket is half full. <laughs> So I sent that. I only sent it to my one boss. He forwarded it to my other two bosses and one of them responded with, it might be foolish to wait too long. <laughs> and I was like, it's amazing. That is like, I could have expected no better response except an actual date, <laughs> but so that was funny. But yeah, so I've had a pretty productive day so far. Ooh, I made my bed so I can cross that off my list. Um, and so I think the plan now is I'm going to spend the last bit of time that I need to spend on um, my COVID plan because I don't want to do more than four hours today. I can probably do more tomorrow because I'm painting tomorrow, so I can probably bring my laptop and do some in between. And then maybe fold my clothes and move them onto my bed so that I would be inclined to fold them so here's hoping that i actually do because i put my dirty clothes in the hamper and it's under the bed because just my room was just a disaster yesterday and it wasn't much better this morning and then i might watch something and do my nails because my nails are just in such rough shape right now i just want to clean the nail polish off and then hopefully putting on fresh nail polish and like a top coat will help protect them because they are hurting and then iron some scrunchies and sew masks and I need to vacuum really badly, especially because I've been sewing so much. So yeah, I definitely have a lot of things to do. It's only, now it's 2.30 because I've been talking for like ages. I've been talking for almost 10 minutes, but now it's 2.30. Um, so I should stop talking and do things. I think I'm gonna change first because it's a little warm in the room, cause, especially because I was going back and forth and the room gets hot. So I'm gonna change. I need to text my cousin's girlfriend because I picked her up yeast and she is going out of town for two months tomorrow and she needs her yeast, I assume. And then I will kind of start to buckle down on these things. Yay. All right, it is significantly later. I've had dinner now, well, cooked dinner, had dinner. My room is like pretty clean other than a couple things on the desk. And by desk, I mean bed. Wow, my brain is not functioning the greatest. Um, 
I did invoicing, so that was good. That's probably what killed my brain, because there was a lot of, like, normally when people take water taxi rides with us, they go in in the morning and they come out at night, or sometimes they go in the morning and they come out the next day, and there were so many that it was like, they went in on Monday, and I was like, nope, didn't go out the next day, didn't go out the night, all right, so I do the invoice, and then when I get to Thursday, I'm like, oh, there they are, they're coming back out now, so... Uh, there's a bit of that back and forth and like my brain hurts, but it's fine. It is 10 after 8 now, so I'm going to watch some Survivor and I'm going to iron some scrunchies. <laughs> I think I must have like 80 or 90 there. Yeah, somewhere in that vicinity, so it should be fun, but we're going to do it until we cannot do it anymore. Hopefully, like, I would love to get them all done today because then tomorrow while I'm playing d and I can string all the um, elastic through and pin them and then I can sew them on Saturday. I'm a little bit behind on what I was hoping to have done because I was hoping to sew the masks today, but there's only so many hours in the day and I ended up working like work from home working for an hour longer today than I intended than I well than I thought it would take me so it's like six hours of computer work that I've done today and actually got paid for which is new anyway so you know if I get a shower in tonight that'd be nice I also did paint my nails so that's nice some hollow taco unicorn skin but yeah I figured I needed it anyways before I pass out I'm gonna put on survivor and keep going also I need to edit vlogs at some point but oh <laughs> the main reason I came on, I finally have a start date. I'm going out on the 25th of this month, which is what I kind of thought. And that gives me four 14 days, two weeks. We're exactly two weeks up from today. So ah, next week I'm going shopping and um, oh, a little bit of panic there, but I think I'm okay. Like I just need to get food. I think this weekend I'm going to write lists and I'm going to pack what I can, including repacking the totes that I have here because I've just been cramming stuff in and it should be okay. Hopefully. Alrighty, well, it is now the end of the night. I did get my shower in, so the only thing I did not do that was on my list was sew masks, which is a totally okay. I did get all the last of my scrunchies ironed. I finished just before 10, which is what I guessed, so that's good. I'm starting to figure out how long things take. And, um, yeah, so I think tomorrow I'm going to work. I want to only work for four hours, but I have to paint tomorrow, so that might not go quite the way I hope. Um, but we will see. And then hopefully I can, at minimum, get the elastics sewed on to the linings. And um, then we'll go from there. I'm, I'm just so exhausted, though. I need to go to sleep now. So with that, I'm going to say thanks for coming along today, and I will see you probably tomorrow and one day I'll actually edit these vlogs and put them up. I am so far behind. It is Thursday. I think I'm like four or five vlogs behind. Oopsies. Okay, good night.